Look, bro. how? Look, that isn't even all combo. Look at this. This is where I started. Look at look at my life, right? Oh my god. That's crazy. You see, you see, he's like, oh yeah, I can easily activate now, which is fine. Oh, no, I didn't have enough range right there, unfortunate. Yeah. Smoked. What is up, everybody? This is Justin Wong, and we're back with some more Japan footage. Um, and you know, Alpha 3, we played Alpha 3 there, and uh, I got outplayed um, against this amazing V Ryu player named Super Masumi. Hit the like, share, subscribe, turn on the bells notification, and let's get into the video. All right, so we fight against this player named Super Masumi. Um, you'll probably see him in a previous YouTube video. I played an Alpha 3. He, was, he has like this challenge. He, used to, he was playing Ken, but in, for this one, he wants to play V Ryu. And, and I'm assuming maybe this might be his best character or, or whatnot. I don't know. But like this guy was amazing. 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 I felt like I couldn't do a damn thing. Yeah, his main is V Sack. Oh, so he knows the match. He's just very good at this matchup. I'm playing him and everything like that. And I was like, damn, this guy is good. So yeah, I'm playing this neutral. Doesn't throw a fireball. Imagine that. He doesn't even throw a fireball this whole entire time. Right. His whole entire time, he doesn't throw a fireball. He doesn't throw a fireball until I jump and he DPs me. Okay. anti right there. Nice sweep. It's very like kind of like a fundamental war i always, i feel like maybe i guess maybe ryu wins the fundamental wars possibly even though sakura has like staying rounds but like when ryu has hop kick it's like really good like the hop kick oh nice cross cut right there hmm crotch mew kick's really good so he used to play v ryu mirror with daigo back in the day oh man this is when you know he is old school i love the fact that it's 2023 and when daigo was playing alpha 3 well that's like 1999 so my man loves some some Alpha Three. This is a this is like this is like fighting real life Gen at this point. Real life Gen, imagine. Oh, bro, a little whiff punish right there too. Wow, that was terrible. And you know what's crazy? You get a lot of stun there. Like, why did I get stunned off of that? Like, reuse Tatsu does so much stun. It's crazy. Activate. Look at this, GG's. Oh, that combo is so sexy too. That combo is so sexy. Tatsu stun is like 8 times 3, 40. So we lost the first game. That was free. Free as hell. They don't really run A2 too much. Like, boss and everyone runs A2 a little bit, but it's, I don't, it's not as popular as A3. A3 is definitely the more popular game in Japan compared to the Alpha series. Ooh. 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 Okay, we got the combo. One, two, three. So let me let me tell you something about activation, right? If you activate first, that means you lost. And I will explain to you why. No, it doesn't hit crouchers. I'll explain to you why. It means that you gave up your activation. It means you you pretty much gave up neutral for just the burst damage. But because of that, the other person has obviously his full Vism bar. So mentally, he can kind of take advantage of that you don't have Vism and he can activate. In certain situations, he can actually jump a lot more. He can actually take a bit more risk. But I personally think that if you activate first in Alpha 3, um, you are afraid of something. And I did I did feel that after the first game, I was afraid. Oh, see, look. Yeah, I'm in the corner. Nice anti. Look at this. Look, look how much guard and chip damage goes for the overhead. Jesus. Look. For, how? Look, that isn't even all combo. Look at this. This is where I started. Look at look at my life, right? Oh my god. That's crazy. You see, you see, he's like, oh yeah, I can easily activate now, which is fine. Oh no, I didn't have enough range right there, unfortunate. Yeah. Smoked. Bro, the mid the corner pressure with with, with Ryu's Vism is just so threatening with the overhead and low. It's such a good custom. I know, right, Keeves? Like, even that 30% did so much damage. Yeah, look, he's like, oh, you don't got custom? Uh, uh. I think the crazy part about this is that, look, look at the custom. Look, look, look at the custom. It's such a fake. 
Look at this. You see how he does overhead? You see how the overhead, right? Peep how the overhead doesn't hit though. See how the overhead doesn't hit? He can't. So sometimes he can. He just cancels the overhead into a different move. That's like a fake out. Uh, so it's actually insane. <laughs> yeah, he was canceling it out. Nice cross up, stun. Uh. Bro, that taught you. Oh, I don't know the exact number, but I just know like that's kind of like the meta of the game is that when you watch like high level alpha three, a lot of people like try their best not to activate first. If they activate first, it's like okay, you you're 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 better than me. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, so that's kind of how I look at, at at activation in alpha three. At least me personally, is that like if you activate first, that means like. I won the neutral and stuff like that. Oh, look, I activate again. Uh. Oh, I missed the cross cut. Okay, I got I, I, like I have 50%, but that's not it's like it doesn't really do anything right there. The crazy part is how fireballs work in this game. If you guys don't know how fireballs work in this game, if you get hit by fireball from like far, it actually does like one point of damage compared to if you get hit by fireball up close where it just does a chunk of a bit more damage. So like it, it makes me think like fireball is strong and weak at the same time. I get the stun. Uh uh. Go for the offense. You know, sometimes you got to go for the offense right there because I can't win the neutral. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Mm. Bro, he is playing offense. Right? If you notice, like, he doesn't really activate, right? Unless, like, I stun and everything like that. He's like, I'm confident. I'm confident in my game. Oh, I got that force that forcefully activate. Uh, one, two, three, a, a, a. But now he, but now he, he probably what his goal is to push me in the corner. This is okay. I'm fine with this because obviously, V Ryu doesn't get too much like from like outside of the corner. So, I, so that was a good. Oh wow, that sucks. I did I uh, I missed DP there. I thought I won the. I thought I, I completely thought I won right here. Oh man, he I did the DP. It's like the DP was in there, but I guess maybe I did the wrong DP possibly. Mm -hmm. You see, you see, he's just walking me down. This is outplayed, outplayed at his finest. Even though Ryu doesn't look like he has longer limbs and everything like that, he actually gets around of Sakura's longer limbs. See, this is when I I forced him to activate first. I won. Like, right? you see, I won this. I won the exchange because he was like, bro, he's pressing me in the corner. Oh, was there a tournament? Dude, you got who, who, you got practice up. Oh, the crotch meme kick. Again, trying to trying to hold back and everything to walk back out of scenarios. Low four fire. But see, look, all, all of a sudden, how did he win the neutral? Look at the time, too. Uh, look at the time. Look at that. Uh, Anti-air. Anti-air. Oh, man. Super Masumi out here, bro. My man turned Super Saiyan. Why can't I? Let me fight regular Masumi. What's regular Masumi like? What's Why is he super? Bro, I'm close to stun too. Oh, if he DP'd me, I might have got stunned. Oh, nice activation. Oh, okay. Oh, we, we fixed the combo though. It got fixed. Nice check. Oh, he, like the activation look at that that's so good like you see how he does this one right here the activation this is interesting you see how he does that how the top he has like he's flying with tatsu so technically that's actually a air tatsu that's not a ground tatsu so he's doing forward medium kick and then cancel the forward medium kick animation because it's airborne into tatsu to kind of get that trajectory uh, so that's how ryu travels a bit faster which is like really cool it's like vism definitely creates like really cool uh, like mechanics to, to happen like scenarios but like obviously vism is is busted yeah like zangi's flying headbutt it's kind of similar in that in that regards Ooh. get the combo right there this is close this is, oh my god not like this 
This is cl oh, you got the jump in? Oh, the fake cross. I could have won that. I could have won that. Oh, bro, that hop kick is cooking my ass right now. Look at that. It's cooking my ass. Mm, he said, well, he, he said, look, look, he said, he said, what are you whiffing for? Look at this. What are you whiffing for? Oh, uh, get your ass down. Uh, guard break. Sweep again. That, sh that is so cheap. Yeah, put me back in the corner. We always wants to put the person in the corner. Like, Sakura doesn't mind to be either way. Like, where she's at but ryu shines so much when he can push somebody in the corner because obviously the fireballs are stronger because he knows where the distance is he can anti her properly he could just kind of abuse uh step kick and back heavy kick it's like such a dominating character like i feel like v ryu is like one of those like characters it's like he's a good he's a good reliable character but he's not like broken i would say oh uh, look at this combo uh. Oh, and he messed it up. I was mashing custom through it, but does that really matter? Look how much damage. I, I mean, I even the life out, I guess, but I, I guess, yeah, I guess that's not bad. I guess me mashing the custom uh, level of the playing field since he messed up his custom as well, too. But now he has 50%. I'm trying to whiff grab because he. I see that he has 50% in general. All right, there we go. We are, Now we're both at 50. We're both at like activation activation station missed the whiff punish right there unfortunately okay volleyball fierce volleyball fierce wow oh my god look at this activate cheap you saw how he played mad safe right there because vism gives him this activation this powerful activation this is what he does walk back fireball jab right so he's 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 not so he just so he lost the recovery of the fireball actually you know leaving his hand by canceling the animation into stand jab so he could recover faster and then throw another fireball like literally right away right he, this time he did stand light kick imagine if i jumped over actually that was crazy that was like some extra checkmate scenario right there if you look at it right look look at this scenario this one i did not notice that look at that that bro i'm jump i i either jump into the fireball or jump to his kick his karate kid karate kid kick that was like truly truly a godlike anti-air bro well, i'm like what am i supposed to do it's 4-1 right now we gotta try to play more sweaty but i'm just like damn i'm flabbergasted i'm flabbergasted i'm like oh man i thought i did pretty good against him last time he said nah kid i wasn't even trying that's what he said. The Remy Lin, how you doing? Hmm, he said sweep again. Hadouken. He play range like a level eight, bro. My man might as well be a bot. My my man is is Super Masumi robot, bro. He's one of the top tiers views. That's that's actually who we fight next. So uh, look forward to that. All right, look, I got him in the corner. Nice low forward. That's a big chunk. Ah, uh, sure you can. Okay. All right. Look at that. Ah, uh, nice alpha counter. I'm actually surprised he did alpha counter there. Uh, look at the time running out too. Mm, he said, "I'm not throwing fireballs at you, bro." Okay, this is what you call outplayed. Damn, that's when you know he's like, bro, I, I, I can just freestyle against you. I can alpha counter and everything. You ain't scaring me. <coughs> I guess it depends. Like, usually Aism is very popular uh, for, for, guard, for guard cancels, alpha counters. Well, you, I just noticed. You see me? This is when you, this is when you know you see me. I'm like... I'm like, I don't know what to do, bro. I, let me try. Let me try like some look at you. See, I crouch medium kick. I was like, let me try something random. Maybe try every button in the book because I'm like getting like outplayed. Look at my life. He's just outplaying me. Uh, can't look. Like, it's so hard to stop the fireball up close. Like fireball throwing at that range is like so, so sick. It's, oh my god, again. Look at this. Uh huh. No, uh -huh. sure you can. Get off of me. Look at this guard bar. He said, bro, look, I missed it. Of course. You know, unfortunate. Unfortunate. <laughs> unfortunate. 
and that was free and he smoked me 5-1 unfortunate right there bro that was smoked that was like i said that was outplayed bro he outplayed my ass Thank you guys for watching today's video. I hope you guys really all enjoyed it. We work really hard and we're just striving to push the best fighting game content that we can possibly put out. So if you guys did enjoy it, make sure you guys hit the like, share, subscribe, turn on the bell notification, and thank you once again for supporting. And make sure you guys stay safe, stay healthy, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.